Well, it's always frustrating to get rained out of a big game, but Madison College second baseman Tanner Vavra has had to wait for good things for a long time now. But waiting and hard work have really paid off. Jeremy Nichols explains why Tanner Vavra has a remarkable vision for the game. There's an old saying in baseball, to be a good hitter, you need a good eye at the plate. For Madison College freshman Tanner Vavra, his plate discipline can be traced back to childhood, growing up around the game. I always tell him that he should be the best hitter in junior college baseball because his dad's the Minnesota Twins hitting coach. Tanner's dad is Joe Vavra, who's been coaching in professional baseball for more than 20 years. Having professional baseball, you see how things are done right, see how to carry yourself and see how the game's supposed to be played and how what it's supposed to look like. But looks can be deceiving. If an outsider came in and walked in and didn't know who Tanner Vavra was and, and saw him with the Oakleys on and saw him playing second base or saw him taking BP, you would never be able to tell. How about when the sunglasses come off? Do you see it now? When I first noticed that he had one eye, I had no idea until probably third or fourth practice of the year. To truly understand Tanner Vavra's story, you have to start with a family fishing trip when he was three years old. The deal was that I had to stand by him and keep my finger in his belt loop so I wouldn't take off and I'd be away from the hooks and whatnot. And I broke the deal and took off running towards the car where my mom and little brother were. And uh, my dad went back to cast before I had left. And when he came forward with it, the fish hook tore, the fly fishing hook tore across my uh, right lens and uh, ripped it in half. After several surgeries and years of therapy, Tanner regained vision in his eye, but when he was 10 years old, he was poked in the eye playing football at a birthday party, detaching his retina and leaving him blind in his right eye. Doctors told Tanner he'd probably never be able to play sports or drive a car because of the lack of depth perception. My parents just kind of wouldn't take it, and I mean, they would have had a hard time keeping me off the field, so they just kind of, they just pushed me in. I never really struggled with it, I just, my body adapted to it. Tanner was a three-sport athlete all through high school. And in college, he leads the Wolfpack with a 424 batting average. To him, it's just an obstacle. It's something that he's going to overcome. And that, to have that mindset and that kind of determination, it's pretty incredible. It's simply amazing. I can't express how incredible it is to be able to hit, to be able to field, run, do everything normal with one eye. So next time you're watching a baseball game, think about Tanner Vavra. Remember that old saying about good hitters needing a good eye? Nobody ever says you need two. In Madison, this is Jeremy Nichols for News 3 Sports. Vavra was asked if it's tough to hit a baseball with one eye. He says he doesn't remember what it's like to see with two eyes, so he doesn't know anything different.